year when the emotional debate over police, race, and community reached critical mass, New Orleans Saints defensive end Cam Jordan. Yes, New Orleans Saints. Who that? She reacts. Who yes, that? Cam Jordan. He's taking action. As executive producer of the NFL Network's Cam Jordan and the Crescent City Corps, he takes us inside as New Orleans police officers train alongside community members. They do this on leadership, racial equality, and trauma-informed policing. Here's a look. It's always been legacy. I'm family driven. You're going to see reflection of what I think, you know, I, how I should carry myself to how I do carry myself is all from what I was able to watch, whether it be the way, you know, my, my pops carried stuff or my mom's carried things. Um, their don't, their do's, their don'ts, all of it is, is what you see in me. All right, and let's bring it. Do you want to get one more who that in? Who that? All right, Cam Jordan from the New Orleans State. Cam, it is good to have you here with us. And I uh, know, of course, Robin Roberts is so excited to be talking to a member of her beloved Saints. But it's good to see you. And, and explain what this partnership, the, the, the Crescent Corps, the, the idea here is to do what for police officers in training that maybe they're not getting? Man, it's, it's an addition, it's an add-on to, uh, you know, everything that the NOPD is doing now. Uh, you talk about it's, it's a third-party uh, entity that's coming in on its own accord, just providing that community, uh, the c community development, the, the leadership, the anti-racism training. Um, it's, it's something that already had its pilot program running when we got in contact with them. And by getting in contact, we saw the fellows that was, you know, it was m primarily cadets of the NOPD that were taking this course. But, you know, being able to partner with CCC, uh, it sort of expanded out beyond all levels. And you just see the, the transformation, if you will, of, of with the heart opening up of mm. some of these officers. I mean, because, I mean, it goes through a lot of different these classes. I, the sessions I was able to attend, it's just this eye-opening situation where it's like, hey, if we can all see each other as, as our neighbors, as our family members, as somebody that we uh, care and respect, then, you know, we can all be better off for it. And it's really for the community. It's not so much about, you know, what I'm doing or what, you know, the NOPD is trying to open up to. It's about trying to better improve our own community out here in New Orleans. You bring up so many great points there, Cam. And, and you did mention about how when you heard about this, it was a pilot program. There are only, what, 12 officers at the time. You, my man, you stepped up out of your own pocket, more than 100K, so they can train 80 more. Uh, just tell us what more this program, how it's set apart from other programs that we see across the country. This gives me something that I can put my foot behind. I mean, um, I'm standing behind it just because it's, it's, I feel like it's a best chance to put a positive foot for our, for our own community. Um, so my, my foundation, God is love. Yeah, we threw uh, $120,000 into Crescent City Corps to do just that, expand this training to push forward um, what we think is the right step for development for our own community and, and tie in hopefully a little bit more trust, give a little bit more hope to, to our city. That is a great name for an organization. God is love. I mean, you you got to trademark that. That is that is so 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 good. And this this runs in your blood. I mean, you're you have a lot of family members who are police officers. And uh, word on the street, your godmother, Jerry Williams, the first black woman police chief in Phoenix. So there she is. No we put her up on the screen like that. So it is it is so important. This is part of the solution. Bringing community. And, po and policing, bringing them to the same table so they can see one another, so they can talk to one another, don't you think? Yeah, I mean, first of all, you know, when you, when you talk about a godmother, I don't know if I've ever called any one of my uh, godmothers godmothers. I mean, I just, they're extensions of the family. That's just Aunt Jerry. <laughs> uh, but, you know, my, my grandfather was, uh, was a DPS officer for Phoenix. Um, so I've had positive interactions, and that's, it's the positive interactions that give you this, this idea that, you know, you do know that community and, and the police entity can go hand in hand. Um, you know, you, always, you also have negative interactions with police as well, um, and it gives you that that sort of that that dual outlook on you know for the good the bad what can I do to improve everybody's outlook um, and that's sort of where where we get to this this situation um, where you sort of feel hopeless but because of hope because of who we are because of the platform that I'm able to have I'm out there actively searching for what I think is a solution well Cam um, 
Uh, who y'all who y'all have this weekend? The Bills. The Bills have okay. No, no, we've got the we've got the Eagles. Oh, got the Eagles. Oh. Jalen Jalen Hurts and the Eagles. Oh. You see, but um. I, I see I I love Michael Strahan so much I can't even say uh. the Eagles. See, I can't even I can't even it doesn't even come out of my mouth. So that's why I jumped I jumped to the Bills. <laughs> well, Cam, it is so good to have you on this day with us. Congrats yes. on all you are doing there, and certainly good luck this weekend with the Eagles. <laughs> good luck next week with the, the Bills. Bills and the docu series Cam Jordan the Crescent. City Corp airing on the NFL Network and on NFL.com. We'll see you down the road, my man. Hey, thank you. You guys have a blessed one. Oh, you do the same. As my mom would say, that's a good man. <laughs> that's what my mom would say. Good man right there. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.